Hello people. Today we're just going to um, do a quick review of the rolling aerator I uh, picked up over at Amazon. So I want you guys to kind of uh, check this out. Um, it was pretty inexpensive, uh, quickly, quick to put together. I need something to kind of get ready for the season. So here I am kind of doing the typical unboxing. And it's, it's only a few parts, right? You got the major component, the wheel. Be careful, guys. These are uh, spikes on this this wheel. I mean, they're sharp. So handle with care and uh, keep the children and the animals away. Uh, so it's not, not, again, not a lot of parts, uh, moving pieces here. You've um, the little uh, green poles in the plastic. That's the main handle. And these two pieces I have in my hand, those fit around the wheel to kind of hold the pole in place. That's pretty much it. Those are all the parts. So here I am just kind of unscrewing uh, both sides of the wheel to attach um, the uh, piece that's going to hold the pole in place. And um, all you need is a pair of pliers. Uh, if you have a socket set, I highly recommend that as well because there's going to be times where I wish I had a socket set. Um, but pair of pliers, nothing major, no other tools needed, no screwdriver, no hammer. And I'm just attaching the other side here, as you guys can see. So as you are viewing, um, this is pretty much it. It's coming together, um, being clumsy a little bit, so I'm kind of find a, a really awkward time here to go oh, away here to kind of hold this side together so kind of bear with me guys um, again the, the most awkward part of it is trying to get poked by these spikes here right so that's what kind of made this thing a little bit of a challenge but nothing major um, I want to say I probably spent maybe about 15 minutes 20 minutes I've sped the video up as you guys can kind of imagine now I just because I didn't want you guys to you know, waste time just watching me futz around with this uh, these pieces here. Um, you, you guys get the picture. Now I'm just attaching the pole, oh, the bottom pole to the um, this piece here, and it's just two screws. Nothing extravagant here. Um, so now I got the bottom piece kind of put together. Here, what we're doing now is just kind of Showing you guys, hey, two screws there. And so, oh, looks like I played that back again. I wanted you guys to kind of see me retightening that those two areas, okay? So, there's just two other um, uh, pieces on at the top here. And what I noticed was that uh, this design, it wasn't as clean as I probably would like to see. But again, it's only 50-something bucks, right? So... I had to kind of fuss around with the um, the alignment here. As you guys can kind of see, I'm turning it around a couple of times because it didn't go in cleanly. And what I realized is that uh, one of these poles were, were slightly bent, but it's, you know, it's thin metal. So you a little bit of pressure, you, you'll get a snap right in. So here we go. All put together and we're just going to do our first push of our aerator uh, against the lawn. Um, it was pretty awkward, not the most cleanest thing, got to apply a little bit of weight to it, but it gets the job done. I have a small yard, it's a townhouse, so hope you guys kind of enjoyed this, and that's pretty much it. Um, catch you guys next time.